Good morning, good morning. Got a couple of things to talk about this morning. First, I'd like to bring it to the word of Jesus, okay? Let's get this one started early. Jesus, the name of Jesus. J-E-S-U-S, that y'all bowling y'all head so much too, okay? Let's first straighten this word out. That book was written after mankind had been here many, many years, and it was written by a dude, okay? Then the king came along and didn't write all what the dude put in the book, so he altered the book, okay? Now, let me explain something to y'all. You can't even understand the goddamn Bible. That's what tickles me. Y'all don't even understand half of that shit. But you follow it and you worship it. You worship Jesus like he was really God. Come on, man. You fucking with y'all brain so bad. Uh, get spiritual, man. Find out what created you. Something created you and it was not a Jesus, man. It was a God. It was supreme creator or whatever. Whether it was a butterfly or whatever, something created us all. And try to work, and you know in your heart what it's about. It's about love, because you feel it in your heart. Now, if you don't want to accept it, that's on you. If you rather watch television and believe the lies of mankind, then that's on you. But I'd rather follow God, not Jesus, man. I don't run and throw my money in no church. But I feed everybody the love that God put in my heart. So the Christians that want to judge me and call me a sinner because I'm not a Christian as you Christians called it, that you have murdered half the people on earth just so you can spread your word of love and Jesus. Can't do that, dog. The Catholic Church got more billions and billions of dollars that it's sitting on and, put, and they have molested more children than any other. Man, behind religion, man. Come on, dude. You fucked up. And now let, let me address this issue, too. This. Because we had a big conversation with my partner this morning. Me and him grew up as kids, and we all went through the heroin. We went through the crack. We went through the edit. And he got saved, and he's a strong advocate of marijuana being a drug. Well, I, I can't talk to him on that level. We talk about everything else because that's my partner. He can always be my brother and my friend, but we can't relate to that. He can't see it the way I see it, and I can't see it the way he see it because I literally do not see this product as a drug. I used it my whole life. That's right, and I'm not addicted to date. I'm not lighting one yet. I can stay the whole morning with you and not smoke a marijuana cigarette. That's not an addiction. An addiction is I'd be lighting these motherfuckers up left and right if I'm addicted. I don't have to have that. I enjoy having that. It relaxes me. I love it the way it makes me feel because I don't have to deal with some of the dumb shit y'all talking and I definitely have to deal with the dumb shit that TV putting out. So to him, I only keep trying to tell him, now stop trying to judge me, okay? You find your way. I don't, I don't knock your thing. You're not going to make me change my way. He said, well, what you preaching all these messages of love and all you preaching is smoking pot? I'm not preaching smoking pot. I'm preaching sharing love. I'm smoking motherfucking pot. I don't tell nobody on none of my fucking sites to go smoke no pot. I smoke my pot. That's for me. Now, I tell my people it's a good product, and if you want to use it medically, use it. It is not a drug. But I'm not pushing pot on nobody, so don't get it twisted. Now, the other part is this. I'm not going to change my ways because you can't see my vision. My vision is I'm not out here to hustle a dollar. I don't need all them fucking dollars y'all think I'm running behind. You know what I'm saying? I don't need that. I got some money, man. I don't need money. I got enough to survive and live off. I don't need shit, so I'm not chasing money. Y'all out here chasing fucking dollars. Y'all want fame and glory. You want motherfuckers to bow down to you like you some kind of god or king. I don't want none of that. That's what y'all got twisted. I just want to share love, man. I want to share what God put in my heart for people. So if you can't see my vision of love because you're blocked by the vision of my pot, then change the motherfucking channel, Nev. I'm not here to please everybody. I'm here to please whoever want to hear what the fuck I got to say. And as far as for my vulgarity, that's the way I am. I'm a vulgar motherfucker. But that's words that we were taught as kids. That's not words that show my compassion and my love. My actions show my compassion and my love. When I feed my homeless, when I sit down and talk to people home, or when I speak to everybody every day on the street and I'm sharing love, that's what it's about. We twisted. We so fucking twisted, man. And as far as for me pushing Megatoke, yeah, I do push this product because it's a good product. I'm giving one away, three, three, not one, three away this month. Y'all go to Megatoke, buy your Megatoke, Mention my name, Uncle Emo. Take a picture with the Megatoke. Put it on Instagram. The money that I'm going to make from Megatoke, I'm giving back to y'all.